we're going to talk about bullying and how it affected me and how I dealt with it for almost two years and I will tell you how it started so if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and let's go. Hey guys, today we're going to talk about bullying and how it affected me and how I dealt with it for almost two years and I will tell you how it started so if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and let's go. So TikTok took their pages down and then I decided to quit TikTok for like a month or two to see if it, if it would die down. Then I started YouTube, and I started YouTube in 2012, and I'm still on YouTube, and um, the, the beginning of January of 2022 um, is where um, Girls Green Dipper found me on um, Reddit, and she made her old, she had an old YouTube channel. And she was she would bash me in my face. She would say some mean things. Um, she would like not be there for me, and she didn't even know who I was. And I guess she decided to be in that community, and she um, threatened to punch me in the face in one of her videos. And she would just call, think I was laughing at her, talking about her parents when I never did. And let me. And, um, I don't even know why she even started with me. And I guess, like, I don't know how the the other community found me. Um, so starting in, I think it was March or April is when, um, all the other communities started taking my videos and started covering me. And it's been going on, so it started April, so it's May June, July, August, September, November. It's been six months and I still don't have any peace. And um, so I'm not going to say any names. You guys know who I'm talking about. And being bullied sucks. And I wish we could all, you know, you know, stop this, to be honest, because I don't know how much longer I can take. I want to be on YouTube to enjoy my videos, my content. I want to enjoy being on YouTube where I can where I can have fun and not worry about the hate, the bullies. I got called fat, a monster, um, a bad person, um, a shit show, all the names in the book. And I, you know, when I was on YouTube a while back, before this all started, it was quiet. There was no pages reacting to me. And I don't know why they have to react instead of ignoring it. Like, they tell me to ignore it. Why can they? So, still to this day, I'm still getting bullied. And I can't even go live without them swiping my stuff. It's like... When I do my TikTok shows, they still take it because they think it's funny the way I dance or sing or the way I dress. I'm, they call me ugly. They call me a bitch. They call me all these mean names, and it's sad. And I wish we could, you know, build up a bully awareness and help each other. If you've been through what I'm going through right now, comment down below and let me know how you feel about this. I would love to hear your story. I do have an email address, but um, I kind of don't want to give it out. I will leave, um, you can, I'll leave my email to you guys in the description if you guys want to, you know, message me and tell me your story. I hate being bullied. I get called a liar. All these mean names. For what? What did I do? Like, mo a lot of, of, a lot of the, uh, mean community you know it's like they try to threaten me and scare me and I didn't do anything wrong and I wish I had more support to be honest but I'm trying to ignore it as much as possible so I go to the mall or I watch a movie that I love or I do a puzzle or I color 
or I just draw or look for a job or do something or play my game on Xbox or play Roblox or IMBU to get my mind off of it, to be honest. And then when I go back on the, after I take a few days off, I go back on and they have a new video about me like, YouTube's not doing anything about it and it's sad. I'm not trying to bring up Girls Green Dipper, but if she wouldn't have found me, people would have left me alone. It's her fault because she started with me first, the very beginning. And then why would why would she make a promise on her mom's ashes in a comment, which I have still, saying that she's gonna leave me alone and and said I could react to her if she reacts me. She promised me she would leave me alone, but I guess she's just too gullible, you know. Me and her are in our 30s. I'm 39, she's 35. And I just wish all these people would just let me live my life. Like, I have every right to speak how I feel because being bullied every single day sucks. It's like you can never catch a break. And I don't even know how much longer I can take, to be honest. So, I'm filming on my laptop, my, my Apple laptop, because... Using my phone or my tablet, I don't, I don't know. I just like filming where I'm in a nice space, you know. I don't know why people hate me so much. What did I do so bad to get treated this way? You know, if you guys want to start it with me first, I wouldn't have did all this. You know, I'm not, like I said, I'm not going to say I'm a bad person because I keep saying that. But like I said, I did things that, I sh that I'm not proud of, but you guys just have to let it go. Why can't you guys block me on YouTube if you don't want me seeing your page? I do the same thing to you because, you know, I've been bullied in middle school and high school because, because I'm not the prettiest girl. But... I don't know if we're going to be able to stop this, y'all. I try so hard to be nice. Why should I have to be nice? I don't have to change for them. They don't control my life. They don't tell me what to do. They think they do, but they don't. But I just got to I just gotta hold my head up high and know that I'm doing the right thing. It's 1.20 a.m. in the morning. It's November 6th. Is it 5th? Yeah, no. November 5th. So today... I'm probably just going to not, like, make any content. I wanted this to get this out because I feel like, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't want attention. I'm just trying to figure out how we can stop this. So, like I said, if you have, if you have a story like I have and you've been bullied and, you know, let me know because I want to be there for you guys. You know, I want to be that person that would be there for you no matter what. A lot of people in my life saying I'm a nice person. And, you know, I'm just tired of people doing things to hurt me. If you two could see their channels and see how mean they're being to people, maybe they'll, they'll think twice and maybe, like, take their channel down. But YouTube doesn't care about about the rules. YouTube just lets people do what they want and I think that is unsafe to be honest but being bullied really sucks. I hate it to this day. You know they want me to they want my fiance to leave me. They want him to be happy. You know you can't control my my fiance's emotions. You can't control him or me and tell him what to do. If he cho chooses to be with me that's his choice. He's not using me for anything. He's happy with me. And if you guys can't see that, then you might get your eyes checked. But I'm not, we're not breaking up. We are happy. We might not, he, he might, we might not look happy because we had a long day. We exercised. We went for a walk. You know, when we go for long walks, it wears us out. So we don't smile. It doesn't mean we're not happy. It's just we want to rest, you know. We, we went for a walk to the mall, came back, and then we rested, and I got a weird message from someone named Elizabeth 
on my Instagram. I was live trying to, trying to, you know, tell my side of, I mean, on YouTube, tell my side of the story. And they told me to get off. And I was, I was like, why, why did I listen? I'm not going to trust anybody anymore. I'm trying to move on as much as possible. But if you talk about me, I have every right to talk about you. That's, that's how life goes. You can't just have it your way. But I'm going to, I don't know what I'm going to do today, honestly, guys. But I do want to say is, if, this, if bu being bullied, it's like, it's like suffering and a depression. I get headaches. I get headaches from being bullied and migraines. And I wish I could just wake up one day and let God know that he hears my prayers. I'm putting my charger right there just in case my computer dies because it's it's a 2015 um, MacBook Air. And I'm saving up for a um, desktop, Apple desktop, so I'm excited about that. I'm going half on it with my mom, but be, like, I know I'm popular. I know I got fans left and right. I know I got a big number on TikTok and a... Oh, a sort of okay number on YouTube. <sighs> I just don't want to have to delete my YouTube because it would suck. So I put my TikTok and my Instagram private because I don't want people trying to come at me. Why can't you guys just move on and leave me alone and stop worrying about what I'm doing? Go worry about what you're doing because the more you cover me or make videos about me, more people will see then I'm not doing anything wrong, and they're turn on you and come my way. Sorry, my foot fell asleep. I am really sorry, guys. Um, my cat's no harm. My cat's fine. My cat has a small cold because of the air. Because we we turn on the cold air when it's hot out, and then we turn on the heat when it's cold out. So when we have the back door open, um, she likes to look outside, and she gets she has seasonal allergies. So I have to take her to the vet hopefully soon I have to call PetSmart to see if they have any deals going on or I have to save up for it but Harris loves me very much and for you guys to sit there and say things that are not true keep going because to be honest I don't care about discord I don't care about your community I have a nicer community and I'm happy with who I am I'm beautiful deep down and deep down inside and out and I know I'm a survivor, and I know I can do this. I'm not quitting because you guys are trying to force me off YouTube. I'm going to stay on YouTube and be happy and do my content and just smile, smile, smile. If you guys want to keep covering me, you're not. That's, that's not a good look for you. Just move on and do something else. Just leave me alone. That's all I ask. You know, if you don't want me talking about you, then don't talk about me. That's not fair. But whatever. I don't even know what else to say, but I, I really hate being bullied. I seriously hate it, but. You can tell the look in my face. I'm not happy right now. Um, but what do I do? Do I stay on YouTube? Do I take a break? What do I do? Because. I can't go live. I can't go. It's like they control me. They know my every move. Like, why can't I go live on YouTube or go live on TikTok without anybody knowing? Just stop taking my lives because if I'm not talking about you or bringing you up in my YouTube or TikTok live, there's no reason for you to watch my stuff. If you're blocked, if you're blocked on my stuff, then stop making fake accounts to come bother me because I'm going to block you. I'm allowed to have a relationship. You're not going to you're not going to force my fiance to break up with me cuz it's not going to happen. So, if you think for one second you're going to break our relationship up, you're wrong because we're not breaking up. I am a grown ass woman. And I'm going to tell you this now, bullies. I'm the new queen here. And I'm the new, I'm the new, um, boss. I'm Queen B. And if you think for two, one to two seconds you're going to bully me, 
you're wrong. This bullying is going to stop and it's going to stop now. Because if you don't stop bullying me, I will get, I will let my uncles know and they will have a talk with you. Because my uncles do not play around. How would you like it if someone bullied you? How would you like it if someone covered you? You wouldn't like it. So why are you doing it to people? It's sad. It's, it's pathetic. There's people out there that don't deserve this. Neither do I. Do I look like a bully? Look, do I look like a bully? No. I look like a, a, a normal human being who deserves to be on YouTube and TikTok. Yes, I have a lot more followers on TikTok. And I know I have more followers than, well, than some of some of the bullies on YouTube. I'm I'm not famous. I'm not a star. I'm an entertainer and I'm happy to sing and dance. But do what you guys want because you're not going to this is not a good look for you. You guys got to stop bullying people online. Because have you guys read the, the TOS um, rules or the guidelines on YouTube about bullying? Because you get three strikes on your channel. And once you're at that third strike, it's either you stop or your monetization gets taken away. I decided to not get my, I decided to stop my monetization because I cannot risk it. So I decided I don't want to get paid on YouTube. I don't need the money. I just want to do content for people and make them happy. That's all I want to do. Is make people happy and make people want to come on YouTube. You guys are making you you bullies are making it where people don't even want to come on YouTube anymore because they're not safe. We need to make it a safer place for people to come do their content. I don't understand why it, you guys have to think you take over YouTube, but you don't. Every single person that has a disability that is that is a boy or girl. Gay, lesbian, black or white, Asian, any kind of type of race or disability is allowed on YouTube. You can't control what they do. You know, I have I have an intellectual disability. I'm challenged. And you're you're making fun of a, a challenged person. And it's not fair and nice. It's really hurtful. And you're hurting my feelings. But do what you want. But all I know is after this video, I bet you it's going to go viral and where I'm going to have so much support and so many people coming my way saying, I'm proud of you. You're strong. Thanks for the video. You're amazing. You're beautiful. This is it in my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you need to tell me your story, just comment in the comment section. Have you been through the same thing? Or you can email me on my Google, my Gmail. This is Cassandra Ann. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope everybody has a blessed Sunday. Don't forget, don't forget, stay, daylight saving time starts today, so you all have a blessed day. And don't forget to turn on your your, your notifications to get a shout-out. I want to give a shout-out to two people. I'm going to give a shout-out to, um, to my friend Sarah H. I think her name is Sarah H., and I'm going to give a shout out to Megan. And I, I want to give a shout out to um, um, someone's mom. I don't remember your name. But I want to give a shout out to you because you're amazing. And you told me I was your favorite YouTuber. So, um, oh, Stuart's mom. I want my three. If you want a shout out, comment down below and let me know your story. This is, this is your, your girl, your queen. Bye.